Okay, so uh, what I want to talk today is uh, how to use SSL offloading or SSL termination on NetSkiller using CloudStack. So right now this functionality is still in the API, so you will not be able to use it via the UI. But I have code ready for kind of like, there are some discussions around where exactly in the UI this should go, and uh, probably I will be adding it uh, in some time soon. So when we start looking at the uh, UI, or sorry, the functionalities which uh, are in um, the SSL offloading module, so w we do um, certificate validation, certificate, uh, uh, we support certificate trust chains. That means basically you have, so uh, how many of you guys are aware with the SSL and SSL trust chains? Right, everyone, okay, cool. So we, we support encrypt, so what, uh, this module supports encrypted uh, SSL keys, um, certificate chains, self-signed certs, um, yeah, a lot of uh, things. Uh, but the, the requirement here is that all your keys are in uh, .pem or pem format, uh, which is basically most of the people right uh, in these uh, days use pem. Um, okay, so. And also, yeah, this uh, is only supported in the NetScaler. Um, so these are the APIs which, uh, which you need to create an SSL rule and add it to, I mean, and make it work. So the first thing you, know, you need to do is to um, create a load balancer. Uh, so right now, you do, there is a new pro, uh, parameter that I have added, uh, LB underscore protocol, which says what kind of uh, load balancer. 